And it was a bad day for journalists at the Oshun State House of Assembly as operatives of the Directorate of State Service battered journalists and smashed their mobile phones. The journalists were covering a solidarity procession in support of a local government autonomy when the incident happened. One of the journalists, Timothy Agbo of the Point newspaper, said he was accosted by a female operative who could not be identified as she was not in uniform or armed. According to Agbo, the lady queried his mission at the assembly and he identified himself as a journalist. He said the female DSS operative later called on another colleague who dragged him to an unknown place. Agbo added that his resistance towards the unwarranted molestation made the two operatives brutalize him and smash his mobile phone. In the same vein, another online reporter, Toba Jishafe, suffered the same fate in the hands of the security agents. Those two officers must be called to justice. Both of them, they are drunk to stupor yesterday. Even they, they, they can still carry on a test in their blood. The sample of the blood will indicate that they, they, they drank that yesterday. She ordered the, the person, that DSS, that armed DSS uh, personnel, to, uh, to deal with us, that we were badly ways with her. I was not like, wow, why would you mahandle me? Because they started dragging me. The other dragged my colleague, and she dragged me. They dragged me beside the road. And she was telling me that if I repeat that again, I said that ah, I, I need to know who you are so that I will know because you look unkept. You don't look like a journalist. You are not wearing uniform. So you don't have any right to question me unless I know who you are. And so she, she said that she would slap me. I just, I, I took that as a threat, not knowing that she was serious with it. The next thing I saw that she started landing me slaps. She started slapping me separately.